Knitting through the back of the loop is a technique that you will sometimes come across in a pattern. Um, it creates a twisted stitch and um, the way that you do it is like this. So to create a normal knit stitch, of course, you go in from the left hand side of the stitch from front to back and, and knit your stitch. So that's just normal. To create a twisted stitch or knit through the back of the loop, what you're going to do is instead put your needle in your stitch almost as if you're purling. You're going to go in from the right side. So to purl, you would go like that, right? But instead of putting your right hand needle on top, you're going to go in as if to purl, but you're, you'll put your right hand needle to the back of your work. So that's the back of your loop. That's the back part. Knit through the back loop right there. And you'll knit that. So I'll do that again. You go into the back loop and knit it. And what this does is twists your stitch. And it's really, I know it's really hard to see on these little swatches, but all of these columns of V's, these are all normal knit stitches, and a normal knit stitch kind of looks like that. Um, and then they're kind of interlocking one another. A twisted stitch does that. So that's all there is to it. To do a knit one through the back of the loop, you just go in to the back leg and knit it.